Hi, this is a Syncare walkthrough video showing you how to automatically forward an order containing a synced product from the destination store to the source store. This is part of the feature set within the order forwarding system. The full tutorial, which will cover the manual like method is in another tutorial also featured a link will be featured in the description down below feel free to check that out for more information so what you'll need before an order can be forwarded is one an order that contains a synced product as well as meeting these conditions but before we create the order we'll set up the automatic forwarding system so if you click onto this toggle it'll bring up a pop-up and the first option that you have is you can select the contact method that will be attached to this order when it's forwarded you have two options destination store email or the customer email what these two options mean is that if you choose the customer email the original customer email will be forwarded to the source store for fulfillment and when the source store attaches a tracking number to this order the customer who this email belongs to will receive that information from the source store directly alternatively if you don't want to share the customer email with the source store you can select destination store email and what that does is that when an order is forwarded Syncio will override this email address and add in your email address that's attached to the admin for your Shopify account. That way you can intercept tracking updates from the source store directly and then pass it on to your customer with your branding. So I'll click on submit to create the shipping rule or the order automation rule. The next step is to create a shipping rule what you have is the option to create a shipping tier set of rules uh, for example you could set if the order contains products over a hundred dollars you can set the shipping cost to zero or for free or if it's under that amount let's say $99.99 shipping will be then at $15 click on the plus to add in these shipping rules. So now you have your own custom shipping table. What this does is that this allows you to override the shipping amount that you have originally charged on your to your customer and append a custom set of shipping rules for reference on the source store side. So once you have that set up, click on the update button again and then close the window you'll notice that the top bar now this section is highlighted in green that means the auto drive setting is turned on that means any valid order that comes into our system will be automatically pushed so let's get to it so I have an order that is ready to be pushed because it meets these conditions I'll click on markers paid to trigger the order forwarding So we'll create the order. Once the order has been created, this will send a signal back to our app and it should pick up the new order. I'll refresh again, 1310, 1310. And what will happen now is that Syncio should push the order. If you can see, it's already been pushed. You can also see that the order that's been pushed has been tagged with the name of the destination store where it came from. And let's take a look. You will notice that the original order number has been forwarded. The note to the order has been forwarded as well. But because we've set the contact method as destination store email, you can see that 
the original custom e email has been overridden by the email that is attached to this Shopify store. Lastly, this order has been tagged for easy identification. The source store now has the capability to add in tracking information as normal. So when their mark is fulfilled, Shopify will send a email notification to the email that's attached to this order. In this case, this address will receive a email notification with the tracking details and the tracking information can be applied to this email, this order to notify the customer directly. That's how the automatic order for order works. Hope this helps. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out at support at Happy syncing.